if I'm given something like what you see at the top of this page where I have two conditions for c of t, this is what we call a piecewise function. And so it means that there are different things that are true for different conditions. So all you have to be able to do is realize that the, the function is going to be 20 automatically if any of the values are between 0 and 60 and including them. If they're greater than 60, then you have to use this formula for the second one. So if I have c of 40, I need to figure out which part of this piecewise function 40 fits into. Well, it fits in up here. It's between 0 and 60. So I would, don't have to do anything at all. I just know the answer is 20. Now I get 80. Of course, you know it's going to have to be the other one. So 80 is greater than 60. So I'm going to take the function 20 plus 0 0.40 times and my t is 80 minus 60. And then I need to solve this. And so you should get 20 plus 8. And so your answer is going to be 28.